Hello, ladies and gentlemen, to the King of the Ring, and we are finally here in the men's qualifiers round two. And we are here on Raw side. We got four matches here tonight. And whoever wins the matches tonight will be facing each other in, in the quarterfinals of the King of the Ring. And we got ourselves a jam-packed qualifiers round two for Raw here, ladies and gentlemen. It'd be interesting to see who will go on to the quarterfinals. Here we have John Cena, the man that has been to the quarterfinals. I think he went to the semifinals before being eliminated. So here is John Cena as he will be taking on Rey Mysterio. Rey Mysterio did not go far in the King of the Ring last season. We'll see how far he gets today. And here is the Lucha Legend Rey Mysterio. John Cena and Mysterio has had a long history with each other from being on SmackDown together and just recent uh, think about their matches they uh, the recent championship match they had that was back in 2011 when John Cena challenged Rey Mysterio who just won his first ever WWE Championship after winning a grueling tournament something like this, decided to challenge Rey Mysterio for the title that he just won that same night he won it in which John Cena ended up winning the title. I know that makes Rey Mysterio a little bit slighted, the fact that John Cena just ruined his very own, his very first moments with the WWE Championship, not the World Heavyweight Championship, the WWE Championship. And look at John Cena going for an early cover here and a quick kick out by Mysterio. And now Cena, look at the flying springboard into the stunner. Now we all know John Cena can turn to that big match John at any moment. But look at this, Rey Mysterio is not afraid to try to lock it in an arm bar. And John Cena had the ropes there, and now they're on the outside here. But Rey Mysterio with a big counter into a neck breaker. Rey Mysterio did not go very far. I think he went out at qualifiers round two, I believe, or that or quarterfinals. I have to recheck my uh, video from last season. But I know he didn't get pretty far. I think he lost to Santos Escobar, the King of the Ring from last season. But now John Cena and Rey Mysterio are here. Qualifiers round two. Whoever wins this match will go to the quarterfinals. And that's when all the uh, the 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 matches start to catch up on you and Rey Mysterio look at the fly with the crossbody it's a cover one the oh, hard kick uh, kick out by Cena as I was saying the matches start to take a toll on you because with shorter match times which means you get to go back into the ring quicker than usual Rey Mysterio taking it to John Cena here. Rey Mysterio looking to fly from the top rope. Crawl! Hits the frog splash, but nobody was home. John Cena looking to put this match away. Oh! John Cena almost hit with the attitude adjustment, but Rey Mysterio managed to counter. And now Cena making him pay for it. Oh! Hits the sunset flip power bomb. And now Cena trying to 
figure out what he needs to do to put Rey Mysterio away here. Oh, but Cena gets caught up in the roll-up. Could be it. One and a quick kick out. John Cena <clears throat> catches Mysterio. Got him in the corner. Oh, trying to go for something, but Mysterio moved out the way. John Cena and Rey Mysterio going back and forth here. Who wants to go to quarterfinals? And Cena plants Mysterio. But wait, hang on. Wait, that's Jay Uso. What is Jay Uso doing? What is he doing? He's distracting Miss John Cena. And Rey Mysterio is taking advantage of the distraction. I'm pretty sure Rey Mysterio is looking at Jay, wonder what he's doing here. I'm pretty sure Rey Mysterio didn't even know Jay Uso would be here. I mean, because uh, we have Jay Uso, I think this is because of last season where John Cena beat Roman Reigns in the quarterfinals. And Roman Reigns sent the main event Jay Uso. To make sure that John Cena doesn't advance either even more, since you know Re uh, Roman Reigns got out in the first round against Cody Rhodes. And Rey Mysterio looks like he's got Jay Uso in his back in the supporting him, going for a cover off the Hurricane Rana one. Wait, 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 wait! Hold up! Oh my God! The ref to the sea. John Cena have his hand on the ropes. Rey Mysterio just beat John Cena to go to the quarterfinals. That's insane. The referee did not see the hand on the ropes. Oh my god. We just saw who the first man in the quarterfinals is going to be. And it is Ray Mysterio. That blows my mind for real. It will re it really blows my mind. Ray Mysterio beat John Cena with the with the unintentional help of Jay Uso. Unneeded help of Jay Uso. And here we are, second match, LA Knight. Taking on Dominic Mysterio, and oh my god, if Dominic Mysterio advances to quarterfinals, will be Ray versus his son Dominic. And that's gonna have a lot of trauma going into that. Apparently, we're getting reports backstage Roman Reigns sent Jay Uso to help Ray Mysterio win that match. That's insane. That's pretty freaking insane how that happened. But now we have Dominic Mysterio taking on L.A. A Knight. Yeah! And we need L.A. Knight to be victorious. I say we need L.A. Knight to put down Dirty Dom. But in, I'm pretty sure Dominic Mysterio will be happy to win this matchup because it means he gets to beat down on his father again if they go into the quarterfinals. Dominic Mysterio has a huge smile on his face because he believes he can win this match. So whoever wins this match will face Rey Mysterio in the quarterfinals. We're getting down to the wire here, baby. LA Knight picking up his first victory ever in both seasons. In the King of the Ring beating his opponent in the qualifiers round one 
looking to pick up another victory here against Dirty Dom. But Dominic Mysterio, he's looking to destroy his opponent for a chance to beat up his father in the quarterfinals. And this is going to be a, a pretty even match, I believe, with Dirty Dom and LA Knight. But it seems to be more equal on more uh, leading towards Dominic's side. Oh, big back elbow to the back and oh, escaping that. This is going to be something. This is something you gotta keep your eyes on. Because so much can happen. Either Dominic faces his father or LA Knight gets another win. And look at this, LA Knight going for a choke, trying to choke this bastard out. Referee telling him, no, that's not legal. Oh, Dominic goes to the outside, here comes Knight, but oh, Dominic catches him with the neck breaker. Now Dominic's grappling here, oh, trying to go with something, but LA Knight counter with the kicks to the the thigh and look at this oh Jesus sends it to the barricade and now Ellie Knight trying to fight back here tosses his opponent to the barricade and now we got ourselves a count of four Dominic needs to get back in Ellie Knight gets stopped by the referee and look at this Dominic oh hits a big springboard moonsault Catching his opponent off guard with that. And now Dominic Snapmare rolls it into a drop kick right in the face. Into the quick cover there. One and a kick out by Knight. And now Knight got his opponent torture rack. Oh my god, dropping his opponent down on their skull. Into the cover. One, two, kick out by Dominic. And now LA Knight looking to put this match away. BLT Blunt Force Trauma could do it to kick out by Dominic. A big kick out by Dominic sends LA Knight to the top rope. What's he looking for? Elbow chopper. No. Dominic Mysterio moved out the way. And now Dominic. Oh, sends his opponent face first with the Hurricanrana. But LA Knight is not done here. Now we're rolling to the outside. Oh, stomp to the gut. Now we got ourselves a, the start of the count has begun. And LA Knight looking to punish Dominic. Oh, as you can see. Face bouncing off the apron. There's blood gushing out the face of L.A. Knight. And now we got us so a count of three as Dominic Mysterio coming back in the ring. You see, oh, comes out trying to go after L.A. Knight. Oh, into the barricade goes Knight. LA and Dominic Tom tell Knight that he isn't as good as he thinks he is. Sends him back first into the barricade. And LA Knight trying to fight back here. Big elbow and a drop kick to the face. Landing right on the button. And now LA Knight got his opponent. Dude Buster hits. I believe we had a count of six here. L.A. Knight might be in trouble here. Sunset flip into the power bomb on the outside. But L.A. Knight gets back to his feet. Catches some blows. And oh, big four on there. Count of eight. Oh, wait. No, no. Please don't tell me a count out victory. No, don't tell me. No, just as L.A. Knight got back to his senses, it just reached a count of 10. Rey Mysterio versus Dominic Mysterio in the quarterfinals. 
God, I hate this. Boo! Boo! We just saw the first match for the quarterfinals, and it's going to be Rey Mysterio versus his own son, Dominic Mysterio. And that's going to be the first match for the quarterfinals. But now we got to figure out what's the second match going to be. And here we have The Miz. The Miz, one of the most successful WWE superstars of all time. Going all the way back to when he was on reality TV. Saying he was going to make it big in the WWE. And he did. After everything he's been through, The Miz has definitely made it big in the WWE today. Has a hot wife, tons of money, a familiar face. And he is here in qualifiers round two. Beating Seth freaking Rollins to get to this point. But he has a tough competition ahead of him. Because he has to take on Braun Breaker. Braun managed to beat Brock Lesnar to get to this point in the King of the Ring. The Braun Breaker dominated. Brock Lesnar to get to this point in the King of the Ring. And only one man can go on to the quarterfinals. And The Miz is going to have a tough competition because he has to beat the man that dominated Brock Lesnar. Braun Breaker, two-time NXT champion. This is going to be something to watch. And here we have Braun Breaker. Oh! Try to start off strong against the Miz, but Miz tells him no. I see what you're doing. The Miz is a veteran here in the WWE. Just about two decades in the WWE. And he is facing off against the rookie. But a strong rookie at that. The man that beat Brock Lesnar. I just can't stop talking about it. He dominated. Brock Lesnar and he is here in the uh, qualifiers round two against the Miz and Miz trying to keep things on his feet counter into the inverted DDT Miz oh stomp to the back of the head and now Miz guys oh multiple punches to the face there oh Oh, but Braun just got back up. What is Braun Breaker? Oh, back suplex right on the mat. And now he's not finished with these power moves. Big power bomb by Breaker. And he's not finished with the Miz. Oh, my Jesus. Oh, the Miz is in deep trouble here. But Miz is not afraid to fight back. Oh, no. What will The Miz have to do to beat Braun Breaker, this animal? Did you see what he did to Von Ragnar in NXT? And Miz has to face this man? And now look at this. Bulldog off the middle rope. Dropping the elbow, crunching into the sternum. And now Braun, oh my god, Braun looking to put this match away. Military press into the power slam. But wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Omos! Omos! 
He has his music. Wait, hold on. Who's that coming in the ring? Braun Breaker better be careful. Oh, oh, Braun Breaker. There's Omos. But Braun Breaker with the counter. And Omos running away, scared from Braun Breaker. Omos trying to make sure to get rid of Braun Breaker since he seems to be the bigger person, like, like the most dangerous person here. And luckily that helped the Miz out a little bit, but not so much. Braun Omos has gone to the uh, qualifiers round two, and we'll get to that pretty soon, but right now we're still on Braun Breaker versus The Miz, and The Miz needs help badly. Oh, hoo -hoo! Falcon Arrow on the outside. How is The Miz going to beat Braun Breaker? This seems to be Braun Breaker's game here. And oh, into the barricade. Count of six. Oh, big close on didn't affect Braun Breaker, but he sends him into the barricade. Count of seven. Miz trying to get in before the count out. Trying to set the count out victory against Braun Breaker. I mean, to be honest, you would do that too if Braun Breaker beats the count. But Miz is ready here. Irish Rip. Into the kitchen sink. And now Miz got his opponent. Look at that. Wrenching on the neck. And there goes Braun Breaker rolling to the outside. Trying to get some space between him and the Miz. But Miz comes in hot with the clothesline. And now Miz takes him down with the DDT. This could be it for Miz. He could be advancing. No, quick kick out by Braun Breaker. And now Miz, oh, try to go for something, but Braun Breaker tells him no. Got, oh my God, another military press power slam. Puts Miz down, and this could be it for the it factor. Two, no. Kick out by the Miz. And oh, here comes Braun Breaker. Trying to set up the combat. Big back body drop. And this is a good spine buster plants Miz. Trying to go for something there, but Miz, it's going to keep fighting back. Look at the resiliency from the Miz. Neck breaker applied. How is The Miz still in this matchup? And The Miz is looking, possibly looking for the skull crushing finale. Got it, hits it. This could be it. Miz advancing. One, two, no. Braun Breaker with a big kick out there. That big move there by The Miz, the Skull Crusher Finale, the one he uses to put away so many of his opponents, was not enough to beat Braun Breaker. And now Miz looking to do some high flying action. Oh, big brain chop. And you can see the blood coming out the uh, face of Braun Breaker. How is The Miz still fighting in this matchup? And oh, into the barricade goes Breaker. Miz trying to build up his confidence here to outstand Braun Breaker. After everything Miz has been through in this matchup. He is still fighting against Braun. And look at this big kick. Who will be walking out of this match? I'm pretty sure the next big move will possibly end this match. The Miz is looking for it. Got his opponent. Skull crushing finale. One. 
two, three, and the Miz beats Braun Breaker. Somehow, some way, the Miz survived Braun Breaker and he came out of it with a W. So whoever wins this next match will face the Miz in the quarterfinals. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the final match for qualifiers round two on Raw side. We already have two. We already have a match set up for quarterfinals round of quarterfinals round, and we have Rey Mysterio taking on Dominic Mysterio. But in this matchup between Gunther and Tyler Bates, we will determine who will face The Miz in the quarterfinals. And ladies and gentlemen, this tournament has been filled with such amazing matches. But somebody has had to come out this match. And I can tell you one thing, a match between Gunther and Tyler Bate is going to slap. I'm pretty sure this is going to be the best match of the tournament. Gunther and Tyler Bates one on one to see who will face the Miz in the quarterfinals. And here comes Gunther's opponent, Bate, a former NXT champion. Former Heritage Cup Champion. Former NXT UK Tag Team Champion. Tyler Bay has done a lot in the NXT UK scene. But will he be King of the Ring? There's only one problem with that. He has to somehow find a way to finally beat Gunther. Tyler Bay has had a match for Gunther before for the NXT UK Championship. And it didn't go well for Tyler Bay. But tonight is full of surprises. We will see who will face the Miz in quarterfinals. Will it be the ring general, Gunther, or will it be the big strong boy, Tyler Bate? And I can promise you a five star classic from this one. Gunther, oh, Tyler Bate coming out with some spikes. Big uppercut doesn't even phase Gunther. He pushes him off in the hole into a drop kick. And now Gunther, oh, looking to punish Tyler Bate here. Oh, trying to go for a big boot, but Tyler Bate looking for a big three board into the drop kick. And now Tyler Bate taking advantage of a downed Gunther, going after the leg right there, and an elbow drop to the back. I believe Tyler Bate believes that if he can keep his opponent down and on the ground, with momentum amount of strikes, it could put Gunther away. And look at this. Upper cuts right to the jaw. Oh! Tyler Bate going crazy with it. Oh, but Gunther catches him with the clothesline. And now Gunther got his opponent. Big back elbow. And now another knee to the face of Bate. And a Big boot right on the skull and oh! Dropping more knees on the face of Spate. Oh, close line right into the corner and Gunther kicks out of it. And a big drop kick sends down Bate. And now Bate has to roll to the outside, but Gunther is looking very crazy. Oh my, oh my god! Gunther tried to go for a drop kick, but Tyler Bate. Oh my god! 
I told you this match was going to be crazy. Gunda just you're a Nagi slammed Tyler Bay right on the outside. And now a neck breaker. It seems that no matter what Tyler Bate do, Gunther always finds a way to get back on the advantage. Tossing his opponent into the ring. This is not looking good for Bate. And Bate is in trouble here. Power bomb! Oh, but Gunther didn't see the ropes. His foot was touching the ropes. Rope break. And now Gunther got put into the Billy Ghost curse. Submission, will Gunther tap out here? No, he manages to escape it. And Tyler Bate, another European uppercut. Springboard into the back elbow. And now Bate climbing the ropes, he's looking for it. Climbing up, calling his opponent to his feet. Big diving headbutt off the top. And Gunther with a big kick there. But Tyler Bate fighting back. Got his opponent. Oh, breaking the and snapping the fingers. Bop and bang a little bit and a drop kick. Oh, but that's not enough. Gunther is just trying to get back up again. And oh, gets put down with a kick. And a big boot. No, Tyler Bate ducks under it. And now Gunther gets tossed. Duck under. Leaf Frog. Into the power slam. Oh, but Tyler Bate gets up. Oh, but Gunther is too fast. Hits him with the clothesline. That burning lariat puts down Tyler Bate. And now Gunther. Oh! Put it full of his rate on top of Bate. Of Bate. And now look at this. Final Symphony, and this could be it for Bay. Two, no, a kick out by Tyler. Go through looking for that crushing maneuver again. And now the rain goes Tyler Bay. Oh, he goes for it once more, this time on the outside. Go through, it's just so dominating. But Tyler Bate trying to fight back here. Big uppercut. Multiple chops. Lands his opponent down with the DDT. Now look at this. Dropping the knee on the face of Gunther. Gunther gets up to his feet. Oh, blocks the attack by uh, Tyler. And now, oh, sent into the steel steps goes Bate. And we got ourselves a count of six here. I really would prefer not another count out victory. It looks like Gunther is saying Bait doesn't deserve to be pinned by him. He's a step in the count out. But Tyler manages to get back to his feet and it scares Gunther. And in the rain goes, no, bounce off the apron. And now Bait. Oh, Bait is in trouble. Oh my god. And Bate is still not giving up in this matchup. Big head scissors. They need to get this action back inside the ring. And Tyler Bate is feeling himself here. Kick no. Tyler Bate gets dodged. Big drop kick. Another drop kick. Tyler Bate feeling the comeback. Crossbody connects. And into the cover could be it. One, two, no, a kick out by Gunther. And a big kick by Gunther there. Oh, counter by Gunther. And now Irish rip. Oh, they bump into each other. Oh, Tyler Bay trying to go with something. And now Gunther, oh, bounces his opponent off the top rope. Goes for the knee drop once more. Now Gunther, oh knee right to the jaw. I'm pretty sure this is game for Gunther into the rear naked choke. Will Tyler Bates tap out? Well, he's trying to struggle. Oh, but he has to tap out. A wonderful match 
ends his submission for Gunther. He will be facing The Miz in the quarterfinals. So that's the second match. So we have two matches. Rey Mysterio versus Dominic Mysterio. And The Miz versus Gunther will be here for SmackDown. Qualifiers round two.